Hi everyone, thank you for joining me for episode number 61 of AppScan Tuesdays. Last week we had a very interesting session, if you haven't seen it, I invite you to take a look. It was on the launch of version 10.05, uh, in which Ran showed some demos about IAST in AppScan Enterprise. Today we are going to talk about something completely different. We are going to talk about an offering, let's call it, that we have. And to help with that, I'm bringing Peter to the studio again. Hi, Peter. Hey, Don. Hey, everyone. Thank you very much for coming again. I missed you and the high ratings of your sessions. So I'm having high hope for this one also. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and today we are not going to demo, don't drop, no one, because we don't want to steal the thunder for the actual item that we want to talk about in and in that item there is way more than that just demo you can actually get your hands dirty with AppScan and and learn how to use it so workshop innovation workshops tell me more about this peter what does it mean yeah so um the hands-on innovation workshop is basically um you know something that we're kind of offering to all the customers out there and it's free went to sign up and um, these workshops allow you to basically like you said you know get your hands dirty with you know playing with our solution um, and trying out for free um, and you know it's great that obviously we have uh, our our you know instructors and SMEs that are our, our instructors that are leading these you know innovation workshops mm -hmm. um, and they can kind of take you through um, you know, you know how to use AppScan, and sometimes we give tips and tricks in some of these sessions, and uh, we also showcase and and uh, talk about the latest innovation that we have in the product. So, so think about it. If you're one of those that actually watch the channel, and I appreciate that, we have uh, a lot of views, and I'm happy about that. And you see all the demos, and you're excited about that. If you goes to if you go to these hands-on workshops, as Peter said, with no cost, you get access. To, to machines that you can try it yourself. Anything that you, sh you see in those demos and more with Peters and others, SMEs that can guide you. Mm -hmm. Peter, so basically, just as a use case, if I am a customer of AppScan Enterprise, for example, and I hear and I see on the channel all the great things about ASOC, you can, I can a a join an uh, ASOC workshop and try it? Okay. Yeah, definitely. So yeah, we have we have these ASOC workshops that are kind of scheduled uh, regularly. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, it's scheduled, um, you know, actually, uh, globally in different time zones, which is a, a good thing, because, you know, we're, we're, uh, we're, we're making sure that everyone can attend it, right. So if you're, if you're in Singapore, you can actually attend the Singapore event in APAC. Mm -hmm. We have ones in North America, um, and you know they're the repeat session in maybe in EU as well, like Europe. So um, you know if you miss one, that's fine. You can go to the other ones that we have. And and, and just you know, said ASOC for no good yeah. reason. We have it for all the products, right? Yes, we have it all for for all the products, like ASOC, Enterprise, Standard, and uh, and Source as well. Yeah. You know what, Peter? Let's let's dive into more details description. I think you may you prepared some slides for it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, let's let's take a look here. Yeah, okay. So yeah, let me let me get into a little bit of uh, uh, more details of, of what the whole hands-on innovation workshop um, is is all about. Um, so again, it, it is it is a workshop that is free and um, it allows you know any customers or users of AppScan. You know, if you're an existing user of AppScan, you can also join the workshop as well, and to get some of your you know hands-on experience of our our solution. So. Um, you know, it's just, like I said, it's, it's, uh, available in different time zones. We're going to have mm -hmm. this regularly, um, every month and for each topic, it's going to rotate every month, um, available to, to different geographies. Um, eventually you guys will be able to, to see like a calendar of all the events that we're ha have, having for, um, these innovation workshops. And on top of that, there's other events as well that we do. So, um, so kind of look out for those calendars that that's uh, coming up. And um, just to ask, who is the target audience? Is it newbies? Is it 
experts wanting to sharpen their skills. Who do you think is the main target? Yeah, so these are definitely a lot more, um, uh, I would say it's an introductory co course or kind of introductory workshop. But at the same time, we do go into some of the new features and in innovation in, in this innovation workshop. So that's why it's called innovation because um, we go through stuff like web services testing for AppScan standards. So, um, you know, for those that, that don't know about web services testing, they can learn about it. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then one of the great things is that, like I said, all of, there's a bunch of SMEs globally for AppScan, um, and there, there, there are instructors for these events. So you're being led by an instructor that's kind of taking you through a step by step. Uh, and many of these SMEs have different trips, uh, ticks, uh, tricks and tips about how to use AppScan. So, um, you know, it, it's very nice for you, for everyone to kind of join some of these events and, and learn from these F SMEs. Um, and like you said, you know, everyone gets their own student machine. So everyone gets to have uh, their hands on, you know, app with AppScan, uh, you know, play around with, you know, scanning using AppScan standard, AppScan source, enterprise, or even ASOC. And then we kind of go through all the different types of technologies that we have um, to offer an HCL AppScan. And then, um, you know, what's really in it. So we have, we, we do offer two or four hours virtual uh, um, instructor led workshops. So depending on the topic itself and, and where, you know, where it is, where it's happening. Um, and like I said, it's introductory, but we do go into some of the uh, newer kind of features. If there's a new release, just like recently we have 1005 release. Um, then, you know, the workshop that you're working with will have the latest 1005 to, for you to play with. Um, and, you know, typically we'll, you know, give people break, obviously, for such a, a long time of, of uh, these workshops. And, um, you know, along with it, we go through and talk about the different license model because, you know, typically that's where, you know, um, after you play with the product, you don't know what the license model looks like. We kind of go through an overview of that so you have an understanding of it. And then the greatest thing is the interaction part. So we, we keep it interactive. You, during the session, you can ask a lot of questions and we'll have um, another T, um, technical SME in the back end who will actually answer all your questions for you. Um, so it's a great opportunity for you to come and uh, not only learn, but also ask questions um, if you have any questions on, on our AppScan solution. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then the fun thing is that at the end we get we uh, we have this little game that we play. Um, you know, obviously this game is, is going to be designed differently for each session. Sometimes we kind of put a twist into it, like Jeopardy, um, and then you just help us, you know, uh, answer one of our surveys at the end to to give us some feedback on how how we did and and maybe you know what kind of topics you want to hear next time. But um, you know. One of the things is that you know we have surprises. So there's <laughs> the surprises is that we're going to give out prizes at, in some of these sessions. You never know. You, you'll probably receive something from us. Not only that yeah. we don't charge people, we actually give them some prizes sometimes. Uh, yeah. When they exactly. So yeah. I saw some of the feedbacks, and it's you know people can decide to think that I'm not objective, but I saw really good feedbacks. Do you see people mm -hmm. returning? I'm really curious. Yeah, so like you know, all of these topics here. Some of the some of the the users that or customers that attend our let's say AppScan DAS and SAS, mm -hmm. um, you know, they will they will come onto our AppScan on Cloud one for the next you know the next uh, round, and then if we have an AppScan Enterprise, you'll see you know you'll see them on on there as well. And everyone's really eager to learn this, and you know, we have quite a very massive turnout on these uh, very popular. And people love to learn it. So, um, you know, and, and again, this is just kind of like the topics that we have for four hours. Um, four hours go by really fast because, you know, we have a lot of fun in these um, hands on workshops. And we also have the shorter ones where we kind of dive into specific topics like AppScan Standard or AppScan Source, uh, which are shorter for two hours. So, you know, depending on what you what caters to you or what available time you have, um, you know, these are all kind of scheduled regularly in the future for uh, for every month, so. And if you in the audience ask yourself, why are we giving this for free and not charging like most vendors? 
Uh, first of all, we are not like most vendors. The second thing is, as, as you may know from other sessions, um, we have a lot of, lot of new vend uh, customers out there. Just in the past quarter, we had more than 50 new companies that chose to go with AppScan and even uh, over the competition, they weren't our customers before. So we understand the need to learn how to use the tool. We want to mm -hmm. make sure that you, you know how to use the tool, how you make the best, the most out of, of our, the AppScan products. So we decided to give it for you. Yeah, we have some really good feedbacks too from customers because you know once you go through this workshop, some some go, wow, we didn't know that your product is so integrated or so integrated seamlessly from product to product. Um, and you know sometimes uh, you know they, they just don't get the opportunity to sit down and learn these things properly. So this workshop really gives them a, a good opportunity to understand how, how how everything works together and how it should work together. Um, and, and like I said, we share best practices as well during these sessions. Yeah, and one of the important parts here that we have is, again, I don't want it to look as if we, we are trying to sell you other products, but we have uh, different models, let's call it. And you mm -hmm. may be a customer of one module. We want to expose you to other capabilities, other areas, because maybe there is actually another tool that is better for you. Not, ne not necessarily complement, not necessarily another one to add, but. Maybe you want to replace. Maybe you want to move from on-prem to the cloud or from the cloud to the on-prem. We don't want to force you. So this exposes you to everything. And as Peter mentioned, at the end, they, they ask, what do you want to learn next yeah. to build the next session? Mm -hmm. if, if it's possible, hey, Tom, maybe I can kind of uh, show a quick preview of what what you, you get to see in these uh, in awesome. these student machines, right? So. So this is one of the student machines that uh, we typically give during the session to to all the attendees of the, of the workshop, um, and and you know we have everything configured in here for you to uh, you know to to play around with. Um, so typically, you know, we have a lot of things um, in terms of integrations. We we have these integration examples, like for instance, if we have integration to Jenkins, we have that right here, so that we can kind of show. Um, you guys how you know these integrations work we have different examples of how to integrate with the the ci cd tools um for instance if you want to integrate with ant gradle or maven we also have examples for uh, apps scan enterprise apps scan source um so you know we take you guys through those step by step of how to do those integrations um and then you know we also have obviously all the integration to ides for instance like visual studio code or Visual Studio 2019, where we kind of show you how those integrations work. Um, and then all the products are here. So, you know, once once you guys kind of go through this with the instructor, uh, we typically leave the machine on for, you know, a couple days for the students to, you know, to continue playing, playing around with it. Um, sometimes during the session, maybe, you know, if, uh, if we're going through everything and they want to do a review of things, um, they can always kind of take an extra couple more days to to go through it. Um, so that's kind of the beauty of things is that everything is all kind of set up for you, integrated, um, and then you can go in and kind of do a review, or maybe you can explore further on how to like, you know, use other um, other tools that we have that are, that are installed for you to uh, to work with. So, so, so yeah. Here, um, how, how many people join those classes? Do we have a, a limit on how many we allow? Uh, no, I mean, you know, we have we have done upwards limit of like uh, 100, 100 attendees for one workshop sessions. Wow. The beauty of the virtual session is that we can, you know, have as many people as we can. And, you know, there's no physical limit to it. And we kind of go through, you know, these tools in detail and step by step of how to set up a scan for AppScan Standard. We go through, you know, also some of these. Uh, detail of, of, you know, each of these tabs that we have here, as just an example. Um, again, yeah, it, there's a lot that you can learn from these sessions mm -hmm. um, and, and be able to, you know, to understand how, you know, AppScan can provide that value to you, right? So, and sometimes people request for things like, hey, I want to know how to uh, scan web services in, in AppScan standard. And then in the workshop, we'll specifically have that in there uh, where we, you know, go to the postman and show everyone how to run a uh, a scan using, you know, mm -hmm. leveraging postman instead of AppScan standards. So, yeah, you know, these requests are heard and these feedback that we get 
are always really good. Um, and, and, uh, you know, like I said, some of, some of the, some of the customers are very amazed after going through the workshop, how, um, uh, they, you know, they didn't understand that AppScan is, could be so connected and so integrated. And, and so they, they want to see more. Yeah. Zach, um, if you're watching this, you asked me about demos to APIs with AppScan standard and enterprise. This is actually better. Um, you can join one of those workshops and test, try it for yourself and have someone, one of the SMEs demo. Looks, yeah. looks good, Peter. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. So um, one of the things to kind of uh, just to add, you know, that we, we do have an upcoming workshop in Hong Kong and, you know, it's the topic is going to be on AppScan on cloud dynamic analysis testing and I asked. Um, so this is a really interesting topic um, of how to use DAS with IAST. Um, and it's going to be on Thursday, August 5th, uh, 2 p.m. Hong Kong time for two hours. So, you know, registration link is, is open. And, uh, you know, if, if, uh, if anyone wants to join, you know, this is the upcoming workshop that's kind of coming up. You know? Cool. So let's bring you back to the studio. Okay, cool, Peter. This looks really good. And um, if you're not going to be in Black Hat, <laughs> this Black Hat, fourth <laughs> and fifth, and if you are, let me know, I'm there. I'll be happy to meet you. But if you are not, this is a great opportunity for you to learn about AppScan, uh, get your hands on. Peter, where can I find the link to register to, the, uh, to this session? going to be down in the comments. Down in the comments. <laughs> in the description, not in the comments. I mean, description, description. Well, we, we can, <laughs> now we will need to add a comment also. <laughs> but yeah, we, we are including a link. And as Peter said, by the next workshop, a month later, we probably will have a, a page that we can show you with the scheduling and to see all the, the future workshops. But it's very important when for those who, you, who join or not join, but have ideas, share the ideas. Let us know, let Peter know what you want to learn about in AppScan because that makes it much more interesting for everyone. Mm -hmm. so, Peter, any any last notes on this, uh, on the workshops? Yeah, so um, aside from the workshop, you know, there's also something else called the Tech Connect. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, you know, I think we have come, one coming up in mid-August. So one of the things is that, you know, when customers join these, these technical workshops, innovation workshops, uh, maybe they want to go into something more deeper or want to know something uh, a little bit, you know, more, more, uh, more detailed, then, you know, we, we have tech connects that actually does that to go into a little bit more detail on specific features and functionalities. Uh, sometimes we even, um, you know, talk about some of the, uh, the futures of AppScan and, and those tech connect events. Um, so again, you know, those are things where, where it's, you know, connected to this, where, um, if you want to dive deep into things, uh, we have those events available too. And then, like I said, you know, a month later, you'll see those uh, events in, in our calendar. Yeah. And in the meantime, if you can't wait a month, let us know, mm -hmm. put your notes in the comments. We will try to add details as they come along. So, Peter, thank you very much. As usual, it's a pleasure having you on this session. And I, maybe if I won't be drinking too much in Vegas, I will join to this session in Hong Kong. I think it's like seven or eight hours different. It will be interesting to try to join at that time. Thank you yeah. very much. And again, if anyone is in Black Hat two weeks from now, drop me a line. I'll be happy to connect. Bye-bye, everyone. Thanks, Aton. See you, everyone.